Hello friends, welcome to your own channel review day to Z. So in this video, I'm going to tell you a very simple method by which you can do the multiplication in a very fast manner. So this method is known as your crisscross multiplication. Now let's start it uh, by taking an example. First, we'll take a very simple example. Now suppose you have to multiply two numbers, 32 with 21. Now in this method, what you'll do is, you'll first multiply these two numbers, 1 and 2. So 1 into 2 will give you 2. In the second step, you will multiply these two numbers. So this is 1 into 3 and 2 into 2. 1 into 3 and 2 into 2 and then you will add these numbers. So basically you have got 3 plus 4 that is equal to 7. And third step, you will multiply these two numbers, extreme numbers, 3 into 2 and this will give you 6. So your final answer is 672 and in 2 cross 2 multiplication, two numbers with two numbers multiplication has three steps. First you have to multiply the rightmost extreme digits, then cross and then leftmost extreme digits. Now let's take a difficult one. Now suppose you have to multiply 78 with 35. Now again, you will multiply 5 by 8, this will give you 40. Now the answer is getting, giving you 2 digits. You will take the union digit and you will carry the 10th digit. So you will carry this 4 in the next step. Second step, you will multiply 7 with 5 and 3 with 8. So 7 into 5 will give you 35, 35 and 3 into 8 will give you 24. 35 plus 24 is your 59 and 59 plus 4, this carry is your 63. 3 you got and you will carry the 6 in next step. So the, your final step is you will multiply 7 with 3. 7 into 3 is 21 plus 6 27. So your final answer is 2730. So basically using this method what you can do is you can reduce the number of steps in which you actually do the multiplication. So this is a very effective way by which you can mul multiply the numbers in a fast manner. Now let's take another example. Let's take an example of 3 cross 3 multiplication, 3 digits with 3 digits. Now suppose you have to multiply any number, uh, let's suppose you have to multiply 542 with 363. Now suppose you have to multiply these two numbers. Now uh, what you will do is, the first step will be the same. Multiply the extreme rightmost digits. This will give you 3 into 2, that is 6. Second step, you will multiply the next two digits in a cross way. So this will give you 4 into 3, 12. 2 into 6, 12. 12 plus 12 will give you 24. Your 4 will come here and you will carry the number 2 in the next step. Now, let's understand what is the next step. So I will write it separately to make you understand in a better way. So if you have to multiply these numbers, what you will do is in the third step will You will multiply the extreme digits like this and you will also multiply the middle digits like this. So this will give you 5 into 3 is 15, 3 into 2 is 6, 15 plus 6 is 21 and 4 into 6 is 24, 21 plus 24 will give you 45. Now this 45 you will add with this 2, 45 plus 2 is 47. So you are left with 7 and you will carry the 4 in next digit. Next. Now what will be the next step is, let's see here. In the next step, so this was basically your third step. So we are doing now the fourth step, 542, 363. So in the next step, you will multiply these two numbers, 5 with 6 and 4 with 3. So 5 six into 6 is 30, 4 into 3 is your 12. So 30 plus 12 is your 42, 42 plus 4 is your 46. So you are again left with 4, carry. Now in the last step what you will do is you will multiply these two numbers. So 5 into 3 will give you 15, 15 plus 4 is your 19. So this is your answer, 196,746. So uh, you have reduced the number of steps. Now let's see another example. Let's see. Let's multiply another three digit number. Now suppose you have to multiply a bigger number. 
Now suppose you have to multiply 987 with 789. Now what you will do here is, again, this is your first step. 7 into 9, this will give you 63. 3, 6, carry. 8, 9, 72, 8, 7, 56. Now you have to add the bigger numbers, 72 plus 56. So what you can do is, you can uh, just write 72 as 70 and 56 as 50. So 70, 50 is 120 and 2 and 6 is 8, 128. 128 plus 6 is 134. So you have 4 here. In the second step, you have 4 here and 13 you will carry. Now in the third step, what you will do is, you will multiply 9 with 9, 7 with 7, 8 with 8 and then add 13. So 9 into 9 is 81, 7 into 7 is 49. Now you can do 80 plus 50, 130. 1 you will carry given to 49, that becomes 50 and uh, 81 becomes 80. 80 plus 50 is 130. Third step, uh, 8 plus 8 is 64. 130 plus 64 is your 194. 194 plus 13 is your 207. So you will write 7 here and you will carry 20 in the next step. So in next step, what you will do is 9 into 8 72, 8 into 7 50. 6. Again you will uh, do the same method. 9 into 8 is 72, 8 into 7 is 56, 70 plus 50 120, 128, 128 and 20, 148. You will carry 14. So this is basically 9 into 7 63, 63 plus 14 is your 77. So this is your final answer. 778,743. Now I think this is a very simple way. You can reduce the step, you can reduce the time and you can do the multiplication in a very effective way. The only thing you need to understand is how you do have to do the addition and what are the steps involved. I hope you like this video. Do write in the comment section. In, if you like this video, I will tell you how you can multiply a 4 cross 4 digit number and a 5 cross 5 digit number in the next video. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.